be sure to get my good side for this. Yeah, I'm gonna need you to open the door. Yeah, just turn the knob. There you go. Good job, human. All right, well, welcome to my crib. Don't lie, y'all know y'all have always wanted to say that too. You see that? That is what my food bowl looks like on a regular basis. I know, I know, it's hard to look at, isn't it? It's not that I'm not loved, I mean, look at me, I'm adorable, but my human is physically unable to go get his own food, let alone mine. And now we're outside. As I was saying, simple tasks like going to the store are almost impossible for my human. Ooh, it's too hot, let's go back inside. Now let's look at me in slow motion and I'll explain why my human is incapable of such tasks. Here is a great example of my human and I attempting to go to the store and buy some food. Yeah, you see how long it takes him just to put my harness on? My human, you see, is homebound. Sure, he can take me on some short walks here and there, but he hasn't driven a car in God knows how long. My human is just one of the hundreds who are unable to provide food for their four-legged friends on a regular basis. Many seniors like my human are part of a program called Meals on Wheels. Oh, human. This program provides home-delivered meals to disabled and homebound adults. Since humans like mine were getting a week's worth of food, many were sharing their limited resources with their furry friends like me. This is why Interfaith Ministries launched a new program called Animeals on Wheels. Animeals on Wheels is a program that delivers pet food to families like mine, but it's not at all possible without volunteers' donations. You see that? That's one happy pup. Uh, can I eat that yet, Kyle? Twelve seconds later. I wouldn't be eating this delicious kibble if it weren't for the generous donations and wonderful volunteers over at Interfaith Ministries. Who are these magical volunteers I speak of? Well, they are humans, just like you. Now, no times can be rough, but think about all the fast food, all the Starbucks drinks, and the other empty calories that you buy in just one week. That's a lot of money, right? What if instead of that PSL, you donated that money to Animeals on Wheels, and then your human friends followed, and then more humans followed? If more humans were aware that this possum program exists, less seniors would be struggling to provide for their pets. Some of my human friends have set up a website to collect donations. They said they'll also pass out flyers on campus for students to donate to the UCaring site and put the link on something called social media. One of my human friends said she would collect pet food at her work. It's humans like these that make me and my human super happy. Now, if you thought that my face was the cutest thing you ever saw, and you know you did, imagine the face of a senior who is finally receiving enough food for themselves and their pet. Oh my goodness, that was the longest day ever. It's so hard being this cute and adorable. Kyle, can you turn the camera off now?